I, I understand that there are different types of government contracts. What are these? Well, there depends on what you're talking about. On the different types of government contracts, they have three main ones. One's called firm fixed price, one's called time and material, and the other are called cost reimbursable. Those are, there's actually like 25 different ones, but those are the three major ones and all the others are variations of those three. A firm fixed price one would be one where you submit a price, say 10000 to do the job, they give you a contract for 10000 you complete the job, you get paid $10,000. That's, it's simple like that. You still have to have business practices to record your cost properly, but you don't have to present those with your invoices. Mm -hmm. If you go to the time and material type contract, that's one where your contract will say, you're going to provide these services, for example, at, if you're an engineer, at 110 bucks an hour, whatever it may be. And then every hour you provide under that contract, you bill at the $110 an hour. Mm -hmm. And then if there are material costs or travel or, or uh, uh, any other type of cost, you add those to the, to the contract at, at an actual cost. Then the cost reimbursable is one where you actually get reimbursed your actual cost. So if you bid 10000 but you only spent 8200 you only get reimbursed 8200 plus a fee or whatever it may be on top of it. So as you can see, based on that, the business practices are a lot easier under firm fixed price and they're a lot more complex under cost reimbursable. Right. So if you're going after cost reimbursable, make sure you're prepared.